if you see my little uh, catch can from Oroso install, you know, I, I've seen some really expensive ones on the internet, and I go, wow, that's pretty. My, mine was only like a hundred bucks. And I'm like, you know, this is similar. The products are similar to what they use in compressed air, like this right here. Get this at Harbor Freight for nine bucks. It does the same thing. It's got a drain on the bottom. It's got air in, air out. This would go to your manifold so you don't get any oil into the uh, intake. That's what it looks like. Look, it's got a little filter in there so the air goes in through that filter. Whatever's on there drips down to the bottom of the container here to the reservoir. And cleaner gets sucked out the other tube. And this is only nine dollars. They've got bigger ones. You could probably buy four of the bigger or five or six of the bigger ones compared to some of the prices for some of those catch can kits. Only issue is this is made for pressure, right? So the drain closes when it's under pressure and opens when you when it uh, when you shut it down. It's spring loaded. That could be easy fix. Just take that out and just put a valve on there, a regular valve. This is a spring-loaded valve. So when you run your compressor during the day, it closes. End of the day, release the pressure, and the valve opens up, and the water automatically drains. Water or whatever is in there. Something to think about. You know, I thought about this too late. I mean, this is all it comes with, but you put some adapters on here. You need some adapters. Some hose, you cut it in line with your hose and then mount it somewhere with some clamps. This has little screw holes on the top here. Probably make some kind of little holder for it. Yeah, this is the cheap one. I, I just bought this for show and tell. This is nine bucks at Harbor Freight.